my channel today's video is gonna be a tutorial on this hair and makeup slay just an easy breezy beautiful bad to be kind of look um so it's a snatch ponytail and this hair is from premier lace wigs it's a full lace wig so that's why i can tie it up and this baby hair is getting to these baby hairs waves on swim honey <laughs> yeah like this hair is a mood what do you mean like what do you actually mean because it's yakky it's a yakky texture so it was so easy to like get into like a pony rather than using silky hair so i feel like this is definitely going to be a summer vibe so yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this video it's super quick i literally did it in like half an hour like the makeup in half an hour but yeah and um this dress is from boohoo so i'm gonna link that in the description box also i'm gonna have some pictures on the gram so so follow me on my instagram if you want to know see how i style this but yeah i hope you guys enjoy this video make sure to leave a like comment and subscribe for more and i'll see you guys in my next one so we're starting off with laying and slaying this hair i'm using my got to be gel just to you know make sure it doesn't move anywhere and it came pre-plucked so it's super super easy to like slay basically it's easy to snatch which is my kind of vibe and um, i plugged it a little tiny bit but already came pre-plucked so that was a mood so i'm just kind of making it work right now And then I'm just cutting some of the sideburns, etc. And then the easiest way I feel like to make a high pony is to do half at a time. And then you brush the back half, spray some got to be spray, and then tie it down with a silk scarf to make sure it's laid and slayed. It was super, super easy, as you can see. So now I'm going to move on to the makeup as that sets. I'm just covering my darkness with this fawn concealer. And I'm just going to make sure that that base is even ready for my eyeshadow. I'm going to do a really simple look because it's summer. Like, nobody got time to be doing super, super cut creases. And I've been really loving, like, more natural makeup recently. Is it just me? Like, I feel like everyone's more going into that kind of vibe. Like, a more easy, breezy look. Especially for the summer. And I've been loving freckles as well. You guys need to try it. I added some a little bit on this video. But, like, you can't even tell. So, okay um so yeah i'm gonna use this morphe palette to just um put a wash of orange on my lids i think it's a really nice shade for dark skin it's just simple um and also this gold just on the lids really lightly i'm not doing a cut crease because i just think like you know nobody got time for that let's be honest when it's hot when it's hot sis like nobody so these lashes are amazing they're from an instagram brand i'm gonna leave them in the description box and now I'm just colour correcting my face with my Revolution foundation stick. And then I'm going to go in with my Huda Beauty foundation on top of that. I think this is a really nice base just to even out your skin tone. And then the Huda Beauty for like a flawless, flawless snatched finish. I'm still living for this. Guys, it still lasted me. How long? How many months now? Like six months with that one bottle. And I use, my, like, use it like every few days it's really good anyway form concealer to brighten up my eyelids my um nose my chin i've been really into um like the fawn again i haven't used it for a while but i really love the shade like it's so nice and like warm not warm it's like a and um, like an olive-ish kind of shade and i really like that for under eye highlight so i'm just blending that all out with my beauty blender and then Fenty Beauty Contour Stick to contour the face, to add dimension, to snatch it back. Like, yes, still obsessed with this. And it's going to last me for the rest of my life. Like, I'm really being real. Um, So, yeah, blend away, blend away. Make sure there's no harsh lines. And then, of course, baking with my Laura Mercier powder. Not so much baking, but just setting my concealer with that Laura Mercier translucent powder. And I also reverse contouring with this as well, just under my contour, making sure everything is seamless. And then I'm using the a Revolution palette to add some blush, just like a nice um, pinkish orange shade on my cheeks, just to add some colour. I've been really feeling, like just mixing powders, like eyeshadows for your cheeks. It works, guys. It definitely works. Give it a go. All right. 
but so my lips I'm gonna go for a matte lip today shock horror like when do I go for a matte lip but yeah um I was going to eat so I was like there's never a point in gloss it's gonna or it's gonna melt off like that food is gonna see the gloss like no so yeah I just went for a matte lip and I lined it with a nude with a nude with a brown lip liner And yeah, I just added a bit of pink in the middle. Just like a nude little cute little vibe. I'm feeling it. Are you guys feeling it? So my highlight is the Revolution Rock On Weld. As always, make sure you put some on, on your forehead, guys, because the sun, when that touches your forehead, <laughs> you look extraterrestrial. And that's what we are going for. That's what we're always going for. That's always the mood, especially in the summer. On your nose, on your cupid's bow, just everywhere. Okay, cool. So now I'm going to take off my hair. This hair is from this hair is from Premier Lace Wigs, and it came in this box. It's the Yaki textured lace wig. So I just put it in a ponytail, and it looks like this. Ah, cute! It looks so cute. Hello, spice. So yeah, it's jet black, and it's 24 inches, and it's, I love that it's a Yaki texture actually because. Um, I feel like it, it holds up the ponytail easier because when I tried to do it with silky hair before, it's just a lot harder. But using this um, has made it really easy. I'm going to link this in the description box. It's made it really easy to make my hair flat. And then I just put it into a snatch pony. And then here we are. This is like... Um, it's not as obvious that it's a... Well, obviously everyone will know it's a wig, but the texture's a bit more realistic and... I'm feeling this. It's actually really cute. Ooh just get some olive oil and run, put a tiny bit in your pony, just so like there's no flyaways. Because that doesn't look cute. And just get rid of all these flyaways and stuff. So. Just as long as they're not